Alright. And we're off to the races. We have Mount Kitty in port 4 and Leo in port 3. And already a pretty decent string of affairs. We can close out. Oop, good there. It's all damage. Gorgonzola out here asking brackets. He has brackets. It is not updated. Losers semis, I think. Yeah, it's losers semis. Maybe. Wait. F. Blackout and Genast. So those are Genast versus Domino. Yeah. No, so this is losers quarters. Quiet. Okay. I don't really have a means of turning up the mic, so I'll just turn down the desktop, you know, actual melee audio. But yep, uh, this is Loser's Quarters. Um, on the other side of Loser's Quarters we have Domino versus uh, Genast. Domino. Okay. <laughs> Domino DQs. Leaving uh, the winner of this will fight Genas. And it's going to be Blackout versus Jaclonk in both games, apparently. So we're going to be waiting for them. Takes game one. Oh yeah. I uh, was at the bottom of Kalos when you were the last zone. I was still alive, but I, I pretty much gave up when that stuff. I was like, okay, I'm just gonna try the two songs. Yeah, be done. And then I was still alive. Are we going to Pokemon Stadium? He's got a lot of power shields out of Mel. It's honestly pretty impressive. Um. Leo's just dancing around that hitbox, so he's playing Bubble Theory, dude. Yep, there's the jab and the down tilt, and good cleanup right there. Ooh, another. All right, we're up two stocks now. Oh, 
Alright, he's closing that one out. He's only stuck behind. It's not anyone's game. And now we're actually evening it quite out. And the first two stops are pretty rough. We're actually, you know, we're down to two stops apiece. Uh, we are at uh, a little bit of advantage for now, but as long as you get some damage on the board, we're, we're going to be looking uh, pretty even. I'm seeing like a very aggressive play style out of, uh, out of Malcolm here though. Like he's, he's unafraid to go in and try and close the gap, which is interesting because Leo's not exactly camping out either, so they're just kind of both in each other's face. And dead even. Sure enough. He did wait. We are now in the the advantage state with a decent chunk of damage on the board. He's looking to hopefully uh, cut this set a little bit early. We'll see. So Leo now up two. Oh no. Like, this is so late. I beat this so much. 
It's 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 optimal and it's easy as shit, easy ish to land. So even though it looks hype, it's like oh that's kind of just the basic. Like conceptually, like that's yeah. the thing I'm getting at. It's like it's cool like on the surface, but then like you think about it, and you think about you see it, and you're like oh wait, this is actually kind of dumb. That's just a free punish. <laughs> Conceptually, the coolest thing that Falcon can do is Raptor boost an opponent to where they both die off stage. I like his fair one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, GG's. Like, fair one is always fun to watch because it's like it has set no bag, combos, and stuff. Alright. You guys can figure it out.